taking some real time to contemplating to think of the best playoff minute between the Blues and Nashville won't be sufficient, you'd need to make one up. The Predators came into the NHL as a development group in 1998 and played their first diversion against St. Louis on November 14, 1998, an amusement 1-5-1 one one by the Blues. On objectives by Pavel Dimitra, Al McInnes, Scott Pellerin, Pascal Room, and Scott Young, alongside 16 spares from goalie Jamie McLennan. Over the most recent 20 years, the two clubs have had a sum of 106 general season gatherings, including five this year. In any case, while the Blues have since showed up in 22 playoff arrangement and the Predators 13, the establishments have never met in the postseason. It took knocking off the NOS. One two seeds in the Western Conference, Chicago and Minnesota, in the first round to get it going, yet at last the matchup will materialize. With the best of seven elimination round arrangement opening up at 7 p.m. Wednesday at Scott Trade Center. It's an arrangement that will include the main two go all tenders through the first round of the NHL playoffs. The Predators Beggarin drives the route with a 0.70. Objectives against normal and 0.976 spare rate, while Jake Allen was next with a 1.47 GAN 0.956 spare rate. They joined to allow only 11 objectives on 297 shots. Be that as it may, altogether for the two offenses to try and get looks of Allen and Dren, something needs to give. The Blues should make sense of how to explore. Through an impartial zone that Nashville had blockaded against Chicago, while the Predators must discover open shooting paths, something Minnesota couldn't oversee. Mike Yo utilized quite a bit of Tuesday's practice time putting the Blues through drills intended to help them split a trap that tracked up 44 takeaways against the Blackhawks in the four diversion clear. In any case, the Blues realized that a chip and pursuit approach didn't work for Chicago, whose 5-on-5 zone passage dump-ins dwarfed its controlled belonging over the blue line, prompting only three objectives in four amusements. Rin can move the puck as fast as any goalie in the group, and truth be told, he changed over two brisk outlets into helps against the Hawks. Be that as it may, in the interim. The Blues concentrate against Nashville will stay on guard. The Predators' top line of Ryan Johansson, Philip Forsberg and Victor Arvidsson joined for five objectives and 15 focuses in the first round. Johansson drove the route with six focuses and Forsberg and Arvidsson had two objectives each. The Blues had a comparable test against Minnesota in the past arrangement and held the Wild to eight objectives. Mikhail Greenland, who drove the club with 69 focuses in the consistent season, completed with only two in five amusements. Eric Stahl, who had a group high 28 objectives amid the year, was held scoreless. That is the thing that got us here, Yo said. On the off chance that we simply attempt to outgun the restriction, then it will end seriously for us. We know we need to play genuine tight checking, baffling hockey for the other group to play against. That doesn't mean we don't push and get on the assault and attempt to make offense, yet we need to ensure we're keen by the way we do it. The Blues and Predators know each other well. They don't have any postseason recollections together, yet. That will change beginning Wednesday night.